Building on the Premier's announcements, the significant announcements we've made really locking in Melbourne's leadership in nanotechnology, I have two other announcements to make. Uh, the first is a new technology that could really revolutionise the treatment of diabetes. And we all know about diabetes, we know that uh, it has a devastating and growing impact around the world. Nearly one million Australians uh, out of 20 million people presently live with that disease. And if you look at the growth projections going forward, something like one in four young Australian males is either type 2 diabetic or has early type 2 diabetes symptoms. So a uh, Victorian-based company, uh, Interstitial Nanosystems, has developed groundbreaking technology based on the work of nanotechnology Victorian partners to enable people uh, with diabetes to receive insulin but without the needle. Uh, their innovative transdermal delivery patch, so it's a patch that goes on the body, will potentially lead to the to pain-free delivery uh, of insulin and then, of course, of other medicines if this technique works well. And it's going to work well particularly, we think, with young children and people who are needle phobic. The transdermal patch has been tested by the Victorian College of Pharmacy and we're expecting preclinical trials to start as early as September. <laughs> We're looking at clinical trials starting at the end of this year, so we we'll probably look at another two years before it actually gets onto the market. Oh, yeah. So we have things here like a ring that you would wear. The patch would actually be placed into the centre of the circle, and then all you have to do is to wear the patch. And so it looks like a ring, it looks like jewellery that you could actually just wear.